Hello YouTube, uh, today I'll be showing you how to um, install a recovery image on the Google Apple 3G. Uh, first, uh, you must be rooted in order for a ROM manager to work. Uh, then you're going to need ROM manager. Uh, the one that I got, that I was able to get it working was the one with, uh, I believe it's, hold on, give me, Okay, the one that I got it working with was with the version 2.0.2.4. I'll be providing you the link in order for you to uh, download it and uh, just, uh, place it on the root of your SD card and install it to, into your phone. Okay. Um, once you get that done, uh, what you're going to do is you're going to tap where it says uh, Flash Clockwork Mod. And then uh, once you do that, it's not going to give you the specific model of this phone. But what you can do is, you can just choose from any of these, um, and you can go ahead and flash. Uh, the one that I chose was the one at the very bottom here, was the Huawei Ascend. I flashed that one, and what it does is, it will also copy the uh, recovery image for that phone on the, uh, is the Ascend, not, not the second one, it's the first one, okay? So uh, once you get that done, uh, you're going to go to your SD card. You can do that through a file manager. Uh, the one I have is uh, Astro File Manager. So you're going to tap on it. You're going to open the application. And uh, you're going to search for a folder called Clockwork Mod. You're going to tap on that folder. Then you're going to go to Downloads. And then you're going to go to Downloads one more time. It says actually says download clockworkmod.com. You're gonna tap on it, then you're gonna see recoveries, and there's gonna be the copy of the recovery image that you already flashed, which is not gonna work yet, um, but in a minute it will. Uh, so what you do is once you confirm that you have that, that means that you have successfully flashed uh, the recovery image uh, from that phone. Okay, so what you do next is. You connect it through the USB uh, on your computer and you turn it on. Okay, so we give it a second until it pops up on your computer. So there it is. Now it will show up on your computer. Okay, so the next thing you do is you're going to open the folders on the SD card of the phone. And then uh, you're gonna see this folder called Clockwork Mod. Okay, you're gonna open again, just like you did on the phone, to confirm that it, it's been installed. Uh, as I said earlier, it's gonna uh, copy a. Um, it's, it's gonna install a copy of the recovery that you already uh, tried to install on your phone. That uh, it was actually from the Huawei Ascend. Okay. So it's going to come. You're going to choose the one on top. You're going to go to recoveries. And then it's going to be right there. I don't know if you can see that right there. Uh, so what you're going to do is, from the link I have provided below, you're going to download the recovery that was built for the Google Apple, which I have already placed it right over here on, the, on my desktop. Okay. So what you're going to do is, you're going to right click and you're going to hit rename. Okay, now you're going to rename it the exact same way as the one that you already flashed. Okay, so what we're going to do is now we're going to type in the name completely. So you're going to put recovery. Um, dash clockwork. Okay, so we already have renamed it um, the exact same way. So to confirm that, we're going to tap on it and make sure it matches with the one on the SD card. Okay, you can see they're both named the exact same way. 
okay you can see that's the one on the SD card this is the one we just renamed okay so now what you're gonna do is uh, you're gonna delete uh, the one on the SD card go ahead and delete that okay and now we're gonna drag the one that we downloaded that is actually made for this phone you're gonna drag it where the other one was the one that we just deleted okay once it's there you're all set now you go ahead on your phone you're gonna turn off the USB storage now we're gonna wait for a couple of seconds until all the apps show up okay after you have turned off the USB uh, storage now you're gonna tap on the ROM manager once more and then you're gonna go to flash clockwork mod and then uh, here you're gonna look for the one that you already uh, flashed I flashed this one right here earlier so that gave me the copy of the recovery image that we saw on the SD card uh, so now that we have already replaced it uh, you're gonna um, flash it again with that exact same one once more I'm not gonna do it here because I've already done it but on your phone you're gonna use that exact same one that you did earlier what's that gonna do is it's gonna use um, the recovery image that we renamed and it's gonna flash the correct one so once you uh, have done that it's gonna um, it's, it's uh, gonna say it's been successfully installed so now to test it you're gonna click on where it says reboot into recovery and we're gonna wait okay now it's rebooting and there it is okay there we have it and now to make it work uh, you have to switch um, this button up here to the other side uh, to, to enable it uh, for the volume and then you're gonna switch you're gonna scroll down three times until you see this message it says back menu button enabled that basically lets you use the power button as select these are going to be up and down and uh, this is going to be the back button okay so once you um, have this installed uh, some people ask you know why they need this for uh, this is great to back up your phone which I already have uh, it's great when you want to install uh, certain um, apps uh, that are not uh, that cannot be installed uh, through the market uh, you can also uh, flash ROMs you can do many things in here um, by doing this okay even though right now there's no uh, known ROMs for it but I'm pretty sure that in the future there will be okay so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to reboot so that's it for this uh, let me know if you have any questions and thanks for watching